hey welcome to part two of the sims 3 100 baby challenge um hopefully i've got this uploaded today uh i uploaded part one last night i'm trying to quickly rush through what i think of is the bit of the boring bit of the challenge when it's just like one sim and then one baby and try and get a bunch of babies and uh let the chaos begin um Last night was a bit of a mental night for me. Um, I managed to soak a lot of stuff in my bag. Thankfully, for once, I had no money in there. I'm actually no. I mean, I'm thankful for once that there was no money in there. And I had so mostly what got soaked was like medicine packets and uh, receipts. But it was still very, very annoying. I kind of left the game to play a little bit longer. So she's already discovered that she's pregnant. Unfortunately, due to having um, a ton of custom content, her pregnancy every day gear is that she's like naked from below the surface, from on the. So I kind of have her walking around in her formal at the minute. Yeah. So let's have a look to see how. Um, pregnant she is so far. Oh, a little bump. Little bump. She'll be coming soon and she wants to buy a teddy bear. I think I could buy a teddy bear. This is the thing I like about Supernatural because you can buy um, different teddy bears. I think I might go for vampire bear. Damn it. Vampire bear stay. Okay, so, oh, she's admiring the toys. Oh, but she's kind of tired, so just let her get some sleep. Oh no, ah, oh, she wants to go and paint. It doesn't seem too bad. So it's pretty much just a waiting game now. Sorry about my heavy breathing in both today's video and yesterday's. I've kind of don't know if it's the microphone or I'm just really coming down with a cold or something, but it's kind of really noticeable when I was watching back. And I'm sorry, it's not exactly the funnest. <sighs> it's funnest the word I still haven't figured that out. It's not the most fun thing to listen to. But yeah, um, I've already decided daddy number two, I'm hoping to go for Param Singh. I think he looks kind of cute. How much are the bills? $60, that's not too bad. She slept enough. Great, the toilet's flooding now. Ugh. Jeez! Jeez, jeez, jeez. Please. August. Put some pants on. Oh, someone's calling. 
Uh, no. Unclog it. Is this broken as well? Great. I think this is just the general problem of really cheap bathroom uh, sets on Sims that they break really freaking easily. Just need to find a way to make money. Yes, um, I was watching X Sim, I think it's no X Urban Sim X last night, and on her one, her idea was to do to make money was to use honey. Oh, that's my phone going off. I'm trying to figure out. Um, the outdoor activities when I just look at it. Yes, yeah, so you have like a beekeeping box, and then uh, you kind of. Although I don't know, we have to do sculpting or. Ooh, decisions, decisions. I got so I'd like lose like most of my money straight away, so I'll just stay leave it for the moment. So you can just write. She is pretty heavily pregnant now, so I'm hoping the baby might come soon. That'll be exciting. I don't know why this microphone is just too good, or like, it's just not very good enough because it doesn't seem to record just my voice. Uh -uh. Damn it, my mouse is really freaking annoying me. It's one of them wireless Apple ones, which I love normally, but every time I literally move my hand on it, it like has to zoom in or zoom out. Try something else. Oh, yeah, this could work out well. Oh, she's kind of getting hungry. But I think she'll sort herself out. Good girl. And then go back to chatting. going a little bit stir crazy from being inside all the time so I'm not too sure oh baby's coming should I take her to the hospital I don't know I need to check the rules uh, she just goes to the hospital and comes back no nah, I think I'll give her birth on let her give birth on her it's just too awkward trying to get rid of the baby daddy again Oh, come on. Look at her giving birth in them heels. I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you, girl. You can do it. You can do this in your heels. You can do anything. Oh, it's a little baby boy. So, um, I'm trying to think of a name for a boy. Uh, trying to think of a name I would give if I had a son right now, and that name would be Wolfie. Oh, he's already a fetchuso, and he's also grumpy. Oh, he's on some proper like Wolfgang. I should call him Wolfgang. Oh, and here he is. Excuse the like black glove things. For some reason, it's a bit of a glitch in the game. But yes, because he's um. The game's rules. As he's a baby, I can age him up instantly. 
but to age up a toddler I'm going to have to wait either for the game to age him up or to manage to teach him all the right skills to walk, to talk and to go to the potty. So black handles, wolfy rain. Our first baby. No, you want to go to the toilet first, otherwise you're just going to pee yourself in the bed. Oh, you have to clean it first. Stupid neat people. Although I'm more concerned that she casually left the baby. In the... Oh no. Is he wearing heels? Oh yeah, he is. Right. I better just edit him. So let's have a look at him. I kind of think he might have a bit of his mum's nose. Human. Longer. Oh, he's blonde. Wow. I should have called him Draco now. I missed out on an opportunity there. Oh, that looks cute. And then some little shoes. See? It kind of glitches with all the different uh, custom content. It's really annoying and I can't seem to get rid of it. But sometimes it means when I have a baby and stuff, it's literally like a pure glitch and it completely messes up my computer screen. But thankfully, this time Wolfie wasn't. So, and there he is. So, Wolfie is. This moves pretty good, so I'm gonna go and get him to go and play. Get us some toys. How many days has he got till he aged up? He's got another four days. Has she literally just got their own time? Nope, she pissed herself on the floor. Oh, come on. At least she doesn't have to clean that too. Good thing about being in a really small house is that you can just like pick a camera angle and stay there and you still see everything. Go to sleep. But yeah, welcome to the world Wolfie. He's Virgo. What's that on she? Libra, so quite close. He's getting a bit sleepy. So, Mummy Bear's gonna have to quickly potty train him. Don't make your bed, potty train your child. Oh. But if she's hungry, yeah, she's hungry. He's kind of getting there. So grab a cake slice, put away leftovers, then eat leftovers, cake slice. Eat it whilst your child cries for attention. And then put Wolfie in the crib. 
and then whilst he's asleep, you can sleep. It's going to be so much easier when it's going to be a bunch of teenagers and they can do the work. I think I'm going to just continue this like full span. No, I don't want to do anything like that. I don't want to chat to Gladstone. I wonder if I can get him to come around really quickly and like pork. Have I got enough yet to get fertility treatment? This is the uh, question. I think I've passed it. No. He's got like 10,000. How much would it be to teach him to walk? Uh, that's pretty fair. And it'd probably be like. So I was going to go for Panem, Param, but I guess I could, nah, I think I'll just go for Param. No? Fine then. I will go for Gladstone. Oh, okay. Fine. I guess I need to like chat with him a little bit more. The mess in here is driving me a little bit in cray cray, so I'm gonna quickly just go and clean up my house. And I'm really tired, so use toilet. This is the problem being a single mom. Use. Sleep. I realise that I'm being a lot more quiet today than yesterday. Sorry, my mind's too much into the game. I'm less rambly, more tired. It's quite early. Right, it's 11 o'clock in the morning, but I have just woken up, so. I really need to get a job. Just do the easy ones so she can do with the baby. Well, damn it, the child is awake now. And he's probably feeling a little grumpy. Where's his mommy? He kind of wants to go out and play. Mommy's. He's to wake up and feed him. So yeah, and she needs like cake slice. I mean, she's just gonna be eating cake. Oh, don't drop the baby shit on the floor. That's not good parenting. I'll tell you that. I'm sorry, my throat must sound really, really bad this morning. I'm trying to drink to make it sound less um, crackly and stuff but it does sound really bad I was just like listening to my audio a little bit and I'm sorry I'm sorry I need to sound a bit brighter I think later on I've, when I do uh, episode 3 I'll make sure I drink plenty of coke and be a lot more like woo for you guys and uh, to anybody who was listening to that emphasis on drink coke drink coke yeah Shh. how's the baby's bladder Oh, oh, it's dropping, it's dropping. Potty train. I kind of wish potty training kids was this easy in real life. I have like a little brother. And we're going to have to potty train him soon. And it's going to be so gross. And let's go and teach him to walk for a bit. I don't really want to age him up because like effectively when they're kids, I tend to find that they're pretty much self-autonomous they can just kind of feed themselves with like cookies from the fridge and they seem happy and she's going a little crazy because it's so dirty inside i think you can hire a maid but the maid is not allowed to look after the kids 
Problem is, Stone Maids kind of cost money and I'm trying to save money. No. Hopefully he's a fast learner. I kind of really want to get fertility treatment before she has her next pregnancy, just so I can quickly go straight into like twins, triplets territory. I can see him age up well, yeah. I'll have a snuggle with him as well. Because he's so adorable. But he will Yeah. He's your little puppy. Oh, you love him. Oh. He's your firstborn. So he's kind of important in the whole shape of things. I say this as a firstborn, so I'm a little bit, uh, what's the word? Ah, oh, he smells. I'll try and change his diaper anyway. Yes, he's potty trained, that was quick. Although everything now stinks of baby. Empty. Oh, it's full moon tonight, so there should be some interesting stuff going on. Now it's time to teach him to talk. Oh, he's hungry. We'll just do as much as we can before he starts crying. Oh, Bobby. And go and get a cake slice and then go to bed. And put him in the crib. Ignore your phone. Doesn't matter. Just put him in his crib and then go to sleep because you are so tired. I want to get him to a stage where I can age him up to a child. I get fertility treatment and then I think I'll end today's or oh, well this episode. Thank you guys for watching, mate. If you're watching this, then obviously you've managed to survive episode one and you've managed to um, survive my gravelly voice today. So, I feel we're on the way to becoming friends. And that's good. That's nice. I say this and probably no one's listening, so. It's cool. I don't mind. I get to talk to myself and feel like I'm actually being productive for a change. So, it's all good. But yeah, it's full moon, so we should be getting some zombies coming up in the garden, eating our plants, being just dickheads, like zombies. Seem to always be. <sighs> Boring. When's the baby gonna wake up? Should I be cool, wake him up now and just do, although it's going to be fun because I'm going to have to try him. And I, I guess he can share with his mum, bed-wise. It's, it's not weird, that weird. I hope not. Teach you to talk. Let's get this done. He's a smart kid, actually. Like, he seems to be doing well with it. And I'll get another birthday cake because then they can just eat for the next few days. I, I'm thinking, you know, ahead.
Come on, come on, come on. Yes, so right, now he's walking, talking, and uh, pooping in the potty. So now it's time to buy a birthday cake and age him up again. This way all her free time can go into getting preggers. Let's just, yes, and she has just enough for um, fertility treatment. Fertility treatment is allowed in the rules. In fact, it's not only allowed, it's perfectly encouraged. So, black candles, not you, Wolfie. There's the zombie. Zombie's come to the birthday party. Oh. And I have to give him a random trait, so he's over emotional. Yeah, and he's in uh, some nice uh, boots there. I'm just gonna edit him. But other than that, the video is done for today. So thank you so much for watching. Thank you for enjoying my weird voice and my awkward silences and my weird like jerky mouse moves. But hopefully we'll have a better episode next time. So thank you so much for watching and I will, s oh, okay. See you hopefully soon. Bye.